uh, welcome back to my channel uh, in this tutorial we are going to see a software called salomeca uh, salomeca which is salomeca which is a, a open source pre and post processing software for computer data engineering uh, and and also it has codeaster as a software uh, for finite element analysis and also code satan for computational fluid dynamics in this tutorial specifically we are going to see how to draw a simple object and create a mesh for this particular object so let's go into the problem so first download the salamaka software for windows from the website so this is the file then extract the file uh, you will get this fo folder in this folder you will be having a different uh, run bat file so you just double click on this maca salom run maca salom so you will get you will be getting this window just go to uh, geometry just click into the geometry model so here you can see you can see the uh, origin point x y and z axis so now i'm going to create a, a, a small box so using three dimensions i just giving this as a hundred this as a ten this as a ten so you can view by fit screen so this is the object i'm just creating so after that so after creating a geometry we just want to prefer a model for finite element analysis or computational fluid dynamics so for that we just want to create a mess so just move this uh, move geometry into mesh so just select this geometry then go to mesh so that just click create mesh so so our geometry is box so in 3d 2d 1d we have we just want to define otherwise we can directly go for automatic assigning so we can go for exa or tetra just i'm going for extra exa mess just click this exa it shows number of segments so so every segments it will divide that into 15 segments i just clicking okay just apply and close so you have got this okay just select this one then then compute so i'm just computed so this is the mess i have created so so in other way you just go to edit some other options also there just go to edit mess uh, instead of giving number of segments you can give some other options just click this gear up, gear button here we have used number of segment as a 15 instead of number of segments we can give local length just click local length uh, default it shows 10.0995 just change into some less value just i'm giving three just click ok and give apply and close again you just go to mess right click on to the mess you will see there is a gear button just compute just click compute so now we have got very good mess so so very good mess so number of node is 875 number of edges 168 number of face element is uh, quadrangle element so that is 576 number of volume element is 500 544 so number of 544 just click ok so this is xms we have created In the same box we can create for treat mess also just right click this mess go to edit mess in instead of choosing uh, 3d mapped exahedralization we can go for 3d tetrahedralization just click this tetrahedralization uh, here it shows same mean size instead of giving 10 just change into 3 so i just giving 3 just click ok click apply and close now again just go to computer mess now <coughs> this is the mess we have created so uh, now we we got tetra 1834 tetra mess we have 
so number of node is 603 just close so this whatever the mesh we have created is a linear mesh that means a linear element will be having a nodes at only at the corners so in for that So here you can see so nodes only at the corner so if you want to change this linear element into a quadratic element just select this mess modification convert to convert to from quadratic just click this so now the linear element will be converted into quadratic just apply and close now we again go to control add just click here we can see nodes at the mid of the element also so this is a quadratic element this way we can convert linear again we can convert this quadratic element into linear also just go here convert to linear just apply and close now again go to anything you click so we can see only nodes at the corners so this way we can convert this linear element into quadratic element also so thank you for watching this video so please please subscribe my channel for more videos so i will be updating uh, uh, videos in every weeks so thank you